country, Edmonton, Alberta. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. Ray, it's all evened up, but not for long when this one is finally settled here tonight. No, huge game in the series. You want to get yourself into the lead. You want to be aggressive, not timid. But every player knows the importance of this contest that's about to begin. Opening face-off just moments away. You can feel the intensity of this one. Total playoff atmosphere. We're underway. Reads it perfectly, breaking up the play. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. Still looking for our first goal. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. And it's a quick pass to Pullock. Back at the point, they set it up. Here's a short pass to Lee. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. And down he goes as the puck goes free. New York's got a hold of it along the wall. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Quick feed to McDavid. Takes a shot, and that one's turned away. Nelson's won the faceoff. Bailey's got the puck in his own zone. Tries to get it to Letty. Picked up along the wall by Nelson. Here's a chance! Stopped by the goaltender. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Moves it to Nelson. Here's a chance right in the slot. Glove save and he handles it with ease. Seidel's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. No one home on that play. The Oilers take over on possession. Moved up ahead after a nice pass from the right wing. The Oilers have it against the wall. Takes a shot off the mask of the goaltender. Boy, right between the eyes. Now, yeah, whatever you got to do, I guess, man, those guys are lucky the masks are as good as they are now. The Islanders carry it along the wall. Turns it away. That goes off a twig. Oh, and another big stop. Really sharp. Never loses sight of the puck to make the second save. Edmonton's gained possession along the boards. The Oilers move to the offensive zone. Unleashes a cannon. Great save by Varlamov. Lots of time left in this period. Still no score in this one. The Oilers will go to work here in the offensive zone. And that goes off the iron and stays out. Pretty tough to come much closer than that, James. Nobody can score, but the posts aren't helping either. And now he angles it across to Del Cole. Here's a shot. Shuts him down. Russell's been brought down, and we're going to get a penalty here. Slides the puck over to Neal. And let's see what the call is. The Islanders will serve two minutes in the box. Played with fire, he got burned, Ray. Oh, he's digging around for the puck, and sometimes you just get caught. This time the player goes down, and he's got to go to the box. The Oilers will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. This has been a stifling game, no goals yet, but now this power play has an opportunity to break through. Gets it to the other point. New York's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. Moves it quickly over to Sezikis. Takes a shot, and that banks off a stick. Edmonton's got it in their own zone. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Puck picked up by Neal. Nice poke check. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. Quick pass to McDavid. And look at this, a three-on-one. And he stands tall in goal. Referee Shilovac's hand is in the air. We've got a penalty coming up. 
And play is finally halted here. Let's see what the call is. The Oilers have been penalized holding the call. Pretty tough to argue when you've got your hand wrapped around the guy's arm. Penalty for holding. Well, things should open up for both sides here with a little four-on-four -four action. Each team playing with four men, and that means that you're going to have a defenseman jumping into the play. If they don't get a good chance, you know the other team will. Oh, there's going to be a penalty on this play here, James. Quick feed to Letty. Gets to the... Oh, the crossbar! It's like both nets have some plexiglass in front of them. The puck will not go into the net. That one hits the crossbar and stays out. It's an opportunity for the power play unit to go to work now as the penalty expires. Here's a short pass to Lee. The official signaling for a penalty as play is called. Cassian's going to get two for hooking on the play. So quickly into position, now the defensive player's got to scramble. He takes the hooking penalty. The Islanders roll out their man advantage unit, and they've got lots of time with this five on three. Five on three can really change the game. Tip it on its head by getting a couple goals on a rather lengthy power play. Made the stop on that play. The Oilers move it ahead. Dumps it in. New York's got the puck along the boards. Everly swooping in on the attack. The Oilers gain possession of the defensive zone. And they move the puck out of harm's way. Takes a moment behind the net. Moves it to Everly. Gains the zone from the right. Slides it across. Stopped by the goaltender. Now, by being in the right position, James, he gets so tight to the shooter, there's nowhere for the puck to go. Koskinen's a little bit fortunate there. He makes a terrific stop, but he just gets a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Still lots of time left in the period. We've still got zeros on the board. Off the draw, and a nice job locking up his opponent. Puck moved back to center, forcing them to regroup. The Islanders gain possession along the wall. And they fail to go tape to tape. With possession along the wall. The Islanders get a hold of the puck along the boards. Moves it quickly over to Nelson. Oh, and a good heads-up defensive play. And a solid effort by the penalty killers as we are back to even strength. Stopped by the goaltender. I like the work the penalty killers did there. The power play at times looked dangerous, but they didn't give up anything. And the power play is now over. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. The Oilers win the draw. Big time hit against the boards. Tell me this. What would you rather take, against the wall or against the open ice? Oh, no, I want it up against the wall, but you got to get close. If you're a foot or two away, you bounce like a basketball. Big collision. Pulak's got the puck near the back end. Right to the middle. From the slot. Oh. Wrist shot. He scores. Far down. Uh, they all count the same, James, but those feel really good. Far down, perfect shot. Really good shot. The goaltender can't catch it. It hits the crossbar and bounces in. New York's weathered the storm here, and they've taken a 1-0 lead. Always better to play from in front, and they'll want to expand this lead as quickly as they can. Larson's got it along the wing. The Islanders gain control of the puck against the wall. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. The Islanders have it in the offensive end. Quick pass to Clutterbuck. Here's a blast! Denies him! He got all of it! New York's got the puck along the wall. Taken along the wall by Larson. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Quick feed to Sezikis, and the puck banks off the glove, and another stop. Now, I wanted another look at this one. I'm sure you guys were all impressed as I was. What a save by the goalie. New York's capitalizing their offensive abilities here in this first period. 
Kuris wins the faceoff. Picked up along the boards by Nurse. Gets a hold of the puck here at his own end. They've got numbers. Puck grab by Neal. Nurse has got it against the boards. Jabs the puck away. Scooped up along the wall by Lee. And we've got a two-on-one. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. He scores! Anders Lee makes it count. tough for the goalie to read where the heck this thing's going. I'm looking at the shot. I can't tell where it's going, but the backhander beats the goaltender. New York's now doubled their lead here in the first. By staying on the play, James has been the key for them. They've been aggressive. They forechecked it when they get a chance. They haven't missed. Shot, and he comes up with it. New York's moving the puck through center ice. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Cassian's got it on the offensive end. Pokes it away in his own end. Takes the puck at the point. Stopped by the goaltender. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. Excellent stick work on the play. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. Here's a short pass to Cassian. Oh, there's going to be a regret in this one. That might be it. Yeah, that play is right there to be had. They just miss the pass. The scoring chance goes away. The Oilers scoop it up along the boards. Can't find his man. New York's got it along the wall. Here's a shot. Comes up with the stop. Lee's playoff production is so impressive. Among the best in the league in goals here in this playoff season. Past the midway mark in this period, New York's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. Edmonton's got a hold of the puck. And now it's grabbed by Jones. And he slides it quickly to Pugliarvi. Takes the feed. Denies him in front. Yeah, he got out tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. Barlamov's able to make the save, as we see here. This is a good scoring chance, but he's in good position. The Islanders have been the better team in this first period. More scoring opportunities, and as a result, more goals. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Edmonton's got a hold of it against the wall. Drives it to the crease! Save from point-blank range. Lee's been able to fight through the tight checking of the playoffs to be among the league leaders in points in this postseason. The centermen glide into position. The Islanders win the draw. Puck moved over to Mayfield. Takes the feed. Puck scooped up by Letty. Edmonton's got a hold of it along the wall. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. The Oilers look to start the transition game. Taken by McDavid. Sends it over. Fantastic save. Barlamov's able to keep the score the same. He turns away a slot shot. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. Scrum along the boards. Find some space in the corner. The Oilers have it against the wall. The Islanders going to work on offense. Moves it to Ennis. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Moves it around along the half wall. Moves right to the middle. From the... Scores! And Oil Country has come alive! Our coaches talk about getting to the front of the net, make it difficult on the goalie, take his eyes away. Man, he only could see the player's butts in front of him. He can't even see the puck.
Here in the later stages of this period, Edmonton's shown a new energy over these last few minutes. They got one back, but they still need one more in order to tie. Puck picked up by Pellick. And now he moves it to Marcel. Handles the puck. Oh, what a big time stop by Koskinen. Everly's point streak has been a thing to behold. You start to get superstitious on a run. You do everything the same. You wear the same suit all the time. The Islanders lead it here late this first period. Sezikis has won the draw. Oh, what a blocker stop by Koskinen. Yamamoto's gaining momentum. Puck knocked loose in the neutral zone. New York's got control of it now from their own end. Grabbed along the board by Sezikis. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Sends it in deep. Edmonton's gained possession along the boards. Russell's got it into offensive territory. Moves behind the net. Moves it quickly over to Cajon. Gives them nothing in front. Slides the puck over. Look out, a two-on-one. Takes the shot, comes up with the stop. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession, so key in today's game. Nice job tying up his opponent. Coughs it up on the play. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Ennis. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Now over to Beauvillier. Couldn't connect on that pass. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Tic-tac, kaboom. The puck blows up off his stick. He's in a position to do something better with it than that. The Islanders take it across the line. Good defensive stop with the poke check. New York's got the puck along the boards. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Quick pass to Bear. Pass to Neal. Final minute approaching here in this opening frame. Oh, a clutch save! High quality chance, high quality save. Big play inside the defensive zone. Receives the pass. Edmonton's got control of the puck. Gaining momentum along the wing. And change is coming up front as the puck is sent in deep. Quick pass over to Lee. And now he moves it quickly to Eberle. Moves the puck. All oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. Barzell's caught up with the hook and the official saw it. And there's the horn concluding period number one as both teams get on the board. Are you a super fan? Here's your chance to prove it. If you have the best decorated car or home, you could win ringside side tickets to an upcoming game. Still lots of hockey still to come, so get ready here on EA Sports. team unit will start the period with the power play. Battling for it along the boards. Pokes the puck away. The Islanders gain possession along the wall. Oh, what a save in front! Aggressive stop out on top of the crease to make the save on a dangerous chance. The Islanders have it from their own end. Puck sent over to Lee. The Islanders played along the wing. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. They get it out of the defensive end. 
The Islanders get a hold of the puck along the boards. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. To his teammate. Great stop by Koskinen. In front of the net, and the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Koskinen's been taking dangerous chances and throwing them to the curb all night. Here's another one. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. It's 2-1. Gets a hold of the puck. Quick pass to Bailey. Quick shot with the stop. That's a good save. He had to struggle to find the puck. It's a forest of bodies in front of him. The Islanders continue to lead here in this second period, looking strong offensively. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. A chance to clear. Call that a win for the penalty killers on that one. Yeah, he slams it off the glass. Now the power play's got to go back to get set up. The Oilers kill off the penalty. Well, as that penalized player comes out of the penalty box, he can give a nod down to his penalty killing unit. They did their job. Outstanding work. Edmonton's got a hold of the puck. Just a great defensive read there. Set it out in front. Oh, and he missed the opportunity there. Quick feed to Yamamoto. Here's a chance, a two-on-one. Scores! We're all tied up! And now their bench has a little more belief as they've evened up the score. Be pretty hard to do this better than they did on the odd man rush. They move the puck, they move the defender out of the way, and then two passes and it's in the net. Edmonton's counter punch pays off. They've evened things up here in the second. They've had really good legs since the start of this period, and it seemed like a matter of time before they'd punch through. Jones carries the puck in his own zone. Strong defensive effort. The Islanders are on the attack. Fires it into the offensive zone. The Oilers gain control of the puck against the wall. Slides it on over to Cahoon. He got all of that one. Yeah, and it was that guy who's picking himself and his stick up off the ice. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. The Oilers gain possession in their own end. Sends the pass over. Goes full circle with the puck. Oh, what a stop. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. Turris doesn't have time to maneuver himself out of the way of this. That's like a freight train. Lots of time left in this period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Barzell's won it in their own end. Carries it across the line. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Here's a short pass to Ennis. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. The Islanders scoop it up along the boards. The Oilers have the puck now. Puts it on net, and that one's stopped. Varlamov's strength is technically, he is outstanding. Here's a save, and the puck's in the corner. Picked up along the wall by Barzell. Puck grabbed by Lee. Moves it to Pellick. And now he tries to get it across to Barzell. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Eberle. The Islanders will play it from the defensive zone. Nice pass. Edmonton's looking to break out of their own end. Moves it quickly over to Neal. Drives to the crease. Nothing doing on that. Rocks him. Edmonton's got the puck along the wall. The Islanders take possession in the defensive end. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Quick pass to Nelson. And he slides it quickly to Boychuk. Long jam in front. That's broken up. And now it's over to Nugent Hopkins. And he loses control of the puck. Feeds it over to Beauvillier. Pokes the puck away. Scrum ensues along the boards. Directs it on over to McDavid. Right in the open ice. That one's picked off. There's the whistle stopping play. Penalty coming up here. Larson's called for tripping. He's off to the box. 
Once he puts up his little token argument here, he's going to circle around a bit and try and regroup here as he goes to the penalty box. Were you box. a haggler? Always. You never think it's the right call. New York's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. They've been skunked on the power play so far tonight. So you have a little chat on the bench. Guys, notice some things that the penalty killers do, and you try to adjust one step ahead of them. Reaches out and pokes it away. And the puck clears the zone. Looking to break out here on the power play. Quick feed to Nelson. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Hangs onto the puck. With the blast! Denies him on the slobber! Taken along the wall by Nelson. Tees him up! Oh, what a slick stop by Koskinen! Close, but not close enough! Under all sorts of pressure, here's a chance to clear. Puck is cleared out of the defensive zone. New York's got a hold of it against the wall. Unable to reach that one. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. And a good use of the body to knock the puck loose. What a steal in his own end. The Oilers kill off the penalty. Got to give their shorthanded unit a lot of credit. That's a long time to sit in the penalty box when the game is tied and you've just taken a penalty to put your team shorthanded. But he gets bailed out. The penalty kill does an excellent job. Takes the pass. And now it's grabbed by Bailey. Edmonton's got the puck. Sends it over to Yamamoto. And he coughs it up with the pass. Yamamoto's picking up steam. Sends it across. Puck scooped up by Yamamoto. Too much congestion blocks the shot. Pins him against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. Moves it over to Sizikis. Takes the feed. Chance in front. Stopped by the goaltender. Smothered that in close chance. Here's a short pass to Lee. Gobbles that puck up with his chest. And we're going to get a whistle here. Pretty good shot. The goalie's able to get the blocker up on it and put it outside. Here in the back half of this period, it's all tied up. Sasekis has won the faceoff. Sends a pass over. Moves it to Clutterbuck. A chance! Makes the save. The setters will glide into the dot. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. Picks off the feed. New York's got possession at center. Takes the feed. Chance right in front. Blocked in traffic. Strong defensive effort. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. From the left side, takes the pass. Here's an odd man rush. Pachot's got it deep in the offensive end. Big save in front. There's the whistle penalty coming up. Slashing the call here on this one. Now he got his two minutes worth there, James, as he's fishing away, and all of a sudden he takes the stick back and whacks him pretty good. Power play unit going back to work. When you don't get many power plays, you really have to make them count. One goal could be a big difference maker. The Islanders win the faceoff. Moves it quickly over to Pullock. Blocked in traffic. Larson's taking it from his own end. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. New York's gained possession along the boards. Long lead pass into the neutral zone. You saw the lane, Dave James. That's a good pass. Stones him in front. More than half the period has expired. We are all tied up in this one. The Oilers get a hold of the puck in their own end. The Islanders have it against the wall. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Winds up, lets it go. Big save.
Play set to resume with the faceoff ready to go. Great read by the winger to take possession with the two centermen tied up. Great stick save by Koskinen. Yeah, he's a sharp save, James. Right in the middle of the ice, he makes the stop and pushes it away. New York's got it in the offensive zone. Nice poke check. Edmonton's got the puck in the defensive end. And a successful clearing attempt. The Islanders will play the puck from behind the net. Quick pass to Eberle. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. And now he angles it across to Barzell. Couldn't catch up to that pass. Edmonton's got control of it now from their own end. And it's a quick pass to Cassian. Can't catch up to the pass. The Oilers get a hold of the puck in the open ice. A chance denies him! New York's got it in their own zone. The Oilers get a hold of it. The Islanders gain possession along the wall. Stays with it. Quick feed to Barry. The Oilers take it along the wall. Centering pass. Wrist one in front. Put it off the post. So close to this game being untied. But a really good chance. Hits the pipe and stays out. Knocks the puck loose. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Edmonton's got a hold of it along the wall. Here's a short pass to Dreisaitl. Picked up along the boards by Yamamoto. Moves it to Dreisaitl. Gets in front of it. Taken by Dreisaitl. Puts it up front. Shot being stopped by the keeper. He's right on it. Two consecutive saves. Tough ones at that. He had to be on top of his game to make that stop. That's a great scoring chance, and he turns it aside. In the final moments of this period, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Puck picked up by Boychuk. Receives the pass. Smart defensive play there. And the defenseman will head off as the puck is sent in deep. Battle along the boards. The Islanders gain control of the puck against the wall. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Great chance in front. Obstruction penalty coming up. Looks like a hook here. Let's see what the officials say. The Oilers don't like it, but they'll serve two in the penalty box. This is why coaches are always on you to keep your feet moving. As soon as you stop, now you have to reach out and try and slow your opponent down. Another power play opportunity coming up here. You gotta have a short memory on a power play. You haven't scored yet tonight, but that can't matter on this one. Get the puck back to the point. Start moving it around and get people converging at the net. Good clearing attempt to breathe. The Islanders get a hold of the puck along the boards. New York's playing it through center. Here's the pass. Oh, what a stop by Koskinen. Here inside the defensive zone, they get the puck. Gets it out of his own end. We got a penalty coming up here on the play. And there's the whistle stopping the play. Let's see who's off to the box. Beauvilliers off to the box, holding the call. Like every player in the history of the game, he doesn't like the call, but he's going to have to go serve his minor penalty. Puck set to drop. We've got some four-on-four four coming up. Four-on-four four play usually starts pretty cautiously. It takes one missed pass or one missed shot, and all of a sudden there's man advantage breaks opening up all over. And now he moves it to Del Cole. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Move to the middle. Stopped by the goaltender. Koskinen's play has been outstanding tonight from the time the puck hit the ice. He's been locked in. Great save percentage, and he's a reason they're close in this game. Del Cole's carrying it ahead. He's got a step. Denies him on the breakaway. Really good speed to get out in front. Dust the pack. Now it's him and the goalie, but the goalie's better. He makes the stop. Turns it away. Edmonton's got some room to do something here on this power play as their penalty expired. From the left side into the middle of the neutral zone. There's the go-ahead goal, and we have a new game. 
Taking the lead now, you control it. You push the pace, you push the other guys back on their heels. The power play cashes in. They move the puck around and get the puck right into the middle of the slot. He makes no mistake from there. Edmonton's taking the lead. Ray, do you like their game tonight? I do. I like lots of it. I mean, there's been times where they've lost their way a little bit, but now late, late in the second period, they've got the lead. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Scooped up along the wall by Pellick. Picks it off. Look out! And makes the save. And there's the horn ending. Period number two. Boy, no shortage of offense here. Time of the goal. 19 minutes, 47 seconds. And we'll be right back for what should be a very intriguing third. <laughs> Opening face-off for period number three is ready to go. Here we go, put up or shut up for both teams here in this third period. We are underway. Ray, with two periods in the books, what are your thoughts on the game to this point? The Islanders will fight the frustration game as well. They've had the puck a lot, they've controlled play, but they still trail by one. The Oilers scoop it up along the boards. Couldn't find the intended target. In close, he scores! That's how you do it! Leadership to a T! The captain capitalizes! When you get into this position, that puck's got to be off your stick in a hurry. You don't have much time to think about it. Edmonton's widened the gap to two here with a quick one in the third. Really important that you start this period in the way you finish the last. They were aggressive, they got after it, and now they lead by two. New York's got the puck along the wall. Slides it diagonally to Everly. Yes, he What's some open space at center. And that pass goes awry. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. From in close, big time stop. Koskinen's under fire, and he's going to hang on for the whistle. Sometimes you freeze it to give your teammates a breather. Sometimes you freeze it so you get yourself one. He's been really busy tonight, but he's been exceptionally sharp. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. Edmonton's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. The Oilers move the puck in the defensive zone. Into the attacking area from the left side. Moves it quickly over to Yamamoto. Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. Handles the puck. Quick pass to Nelson. And that one's broken up. Great block there. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. Slides it quickly to Bailey. The Islanders move it in. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Now a quick pass to Jones. Gains the zone on the left wing. New York's grabbed a hold of the puck. Quick feed to Nelson. Slides the puck over. New York's got a hold of it against the wall. Moves the puck. And there's the save. Koskinen's got it, and he'll elect for the whistle. Jumped on it pretty quickly there, and like everything else tonight, he's really looked in control. He's had an excellent game. New York's had a lot of good looks on goal, but they still trail early in the third. Edmonton's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Quick feed to Neal. All alone! Denies him! Oh, excellent stop by the goaltender. He read that perfectly. And he slides Whoa. it quickly to Boychuk. New York's in now. Centering pass in front, and they can't connect. Grabbed along the board by Larson. 
And now he moves it quickly to Turris. And that's just out of reach. New York's looking to break out. Sent into the offensive zone. Edmonton's going to play the puck from behind the cage. Slides it up to Cassian. Along the half wall with the puck. Kind of lost control for a second there. Scores! The Oilers light the lamp! A quick flick of the wrist, and that snapshot beats the goaltender. He's in the low slot. He doesn't have much time to think about it. Edmonton's only continued to extend the lead here in the third. They haven't missed many chances. They've scored at will, and now we're coasting home. This neutral zone faceoff set to go, and we are back underway. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. And that goes off a player in front. Here's a short pass to Kara. Air mails it. Did he ever? He's got to bring that down a couple of feet. They've got the defense outnumbered. Moves it to Sisikis. Huge stop by Koskinen. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Koskinen's made an excellent stop here. He follows the puck and shuts down the scoring chance. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. Edmonton's really put the squeeze on here now up by three. The Oilers take possession off the faceoff. Bears moving the puck through his own zone. Throws it in. New York's got the puck along the boards. Pushes it across to Barzell. That pass goes a little sideways. The Oilers get a hold of the puck in their own end. Edmonton's gained possession along the boards. Moves it quickly over to Chason. The Oilers play it along the boards. Jabs the puck away. Sends the pass over. Dishes it to Barzell. Slides it across. Denied by the goaltender. Koskinen's got the puck, and he elects to hang on for a stoppage in play. Now we're in the third period, James. It's pretty safe to say he's been on top of his game tonight. Not much has given him a problem. The Islanders still trail in this third period despite numerous scoring opportunities. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Maintains possession. It's a two-on-one. Simple glove save by Barlama. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. McDavid's won the draw. Quick pass to Nugent Hopkins. Right in front of the net. And that skips away. He scores! Oh, what a play as he gets his own rebound and puts it in. Quick shot on the first attempt, but that rebound came right back to him. And he's able to settle it and put it into the net before anyone else can stop him. The Oilers could almost put this one in neutral here for the rest of this third period. They've dominated much of this game, and the score is clearly reflective of that. The Islanders get a hold of the puck off the draw. The Oilers have it against the wall. Quick feed to Nugent Hopkins. Redirected in front. Scores! No chance for the puck stopper on that one. Well, if he was about four inches taller, maybe he would have got to that. Desperation effort, but no goal. The Islanders are going to make a change in goal. I'm not so sure the guy coming into the game is going to feel so excited. Their team has just been destroyed tonight. The Oilers have really opened it up here in the third period. Impressive offensive performance. 
coming from everybody. They've kept their foot on the gas. It's been in a relentless offensive attack. Mayfield's got the puck. Move to the middle, and that one's blocked. Hammers him into the boards. Puck carrier thought he could squeeze by. All of a sudden, the door closed. Unloads the shot. Puck grabbed by Mayfield. And now it's grabbed by Peugeot. Here's a short pass to Mayfield. Knocked away. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Feeds it to Nelson. They go on the attack through center. And he loses possession of the puck after trying to make one too many moves. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. Edmonton's got the puck along the wall. A chance from the slot. How do you miss that, Ray? I don't know, but we all do. You're right in a scoring zone, and you don't even test the goalie. Snaps one here in the slot. Too much traffic in the lane. They fight for it along the boards. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Nice pass. Stopped by the goaltender. The Oilers gain possession along the wall. Slides it over to Yamamoto. Rips it, and that carries off a stick. Puck scooped up by Letty. Good use of the body on the play. Driving right to the front. Can't connect. That knocks him off the puck. Scrum ensues along the boards. Moves it to Ennis. Right in front with the shot, and that's blocked. Picked up along the wall by Clutterbuck. Now he takes it over the line. And he slides it quickly to Letty. Oh, they telegraph the pass, and he picks it off. New York's got the puck in their own end. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Winds up from the point, and that goes off a player. Takes the pass. Takes the feed. New York's regained possession of the puck. Picking up some steam at center ice. On the attack along the boards. Couldn't make that one happen. Larson stick handling in his own zone. Pokes the puck away. Moves it quickly over to Marcel. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. McDavid swinging the puck through center ice. Play whistle dead because of an offside. Koskinen's done nice work here on this scoring chance to turn it aside. The Islanders have been the busier team in the offensive zone, but they still trail in the third. Edmonton's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. New York's got a hold of it along the wall. Drives to the sweet spot, and he makes the save. Koskinen's going to slow things down and opts for the whistle. He's had a really good night. He's been on top of his game, and there's not been much that's given him trouble. Well, what a quick reflex stop that is. Great scoring chance. The centermen glide into position. And sneaks in and grabs possession. Dumps it into the Ozone. The Islanders gain control of the puck against the wall. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Taken by Nugent Hopkins. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Denies him with a save. McDavid's won the face-off deep inside the offensive zone. And that's the hat trick! Listen to this place! And here come the hats. I love this tradition, although I will tell you, they collect the hats up, they used to give them to us, and you're like, what am I going to do? I'm not wearing somebody else's hat. <laughs> wow, that's quick. Off the draw, snapped right back cleanly. The one-timer beats the goalie, who really doesn't have time to move at all. He's squared up to the face-off. This puck is right on the tape and in the net before he can move. 
The Oilers are on absolute cruise control here in the third. Well, they've built such a large margin. You can use your whole bench and coast it in. Nice job tying up his opponent. Quick pass to Beauvillier. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Edmonton's across the blue line. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Taken along the wall by Puyo Yarby. Can't maintain possession. And some good footwork to kick it away. And it's a quick pass to Cahoon. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. Looks to make a play over to Bailey. Right on the doorstep. Great defensive stick work on the play. Gets the puck over to Yamamoto. Quick feed to Dreisaitl. Can't connect. Sends a pass over. Good battle along the boards for the puck. New York's got a hold of it against the wall. The Islanders take possession here in the open ice. Sends it over. Stopped by the goaltender. But he came out and challenged him. Good save. And, and it's in the net. That's a goal. They're going to count that one. Oh, he looked like he had stopped it. And when he couldn't quite find it, he turns around and bangs it into his own net. That's a tough one. New York's back at center ice. They have a long way to go still here, though, Ray. Yeah, get your scores out there, James. Don't worry about the defensive end of the ice. You need goals. Puck picked up by Barry. The Oilers played along the boards. No one home on that play. With the steal. Moves the puck along the half wall. Move to the middle. Here's a chance. And that one's broken up. Great block there. Down Cole's got it across the line. Puts it on net and makes the save. Picked up along the boards by Peugeot. Pokes it away in his own end. Puck grabbed by Turris. And he can't hang on after that hit. Now a quick pass to Ennis. And he slides it quickly to Neal. Passes it to Jones. Centering pass. Denied by the goaltender. The Islanders get a hold of the puck along the boards. That pass doesn't go. Down Cole's got it in the offensive zone. No room for that one to get through. Sends it quickly to Jones. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Mayfield's lugging the puck. And now he moves it quickly to Lee. Nice zone entry from the right side. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Pins them against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. The Islanders have it against the wall. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. Nearing the final minute of the third. Scooped up along the wall by Chason. The Islanders scoop it up along the boards. He looks deep to Marcel. Directed over to Lee. With possession along the wall. And he slides it quickly to Letty. Denies him with a save. And now he tries to get it across to Nugent Hopkins. Puck scooped up by Russell. Pinned up along the boards. New York's got the puck along the wall. The Islanders carry it along the wall. Wrist shot from the slot. Nothing. The Islanders are a frustrated group. You can feel it on their bench as they miss another chance. Here's a short pass to Nelson. Takes the feed. Receives the pass. Edmonton's got the puck now. Here they come. And now it's grabbed by Nugent Hopkins. Excellent stick work on the play. New York's got the puck along the boards. Here's a shot. Locks it down with a stop. I think he got a blocker on that one. There's the horn, and that's the hockey game. Maybe a simple case of anything you can do, I can do better tonight, Ray. Absolutely so, James. It's funny how you can almost feel the pressure in the game as it's a 1-1 series. Now everything gets more and more critical. They're feeling good about this one, and here they come back out onto the ice, Razor. Unreal support from their fans. They salute them a thank you for their efforts tonight. Another reason why we love playoff hockey. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Good night.